Hello everyone and welcome to the Project Cars 2. Going to be doing a bit of a race on Bathurst, 10 laps. Um, we're qualifying, so we'll qualify for 5 minutes and try and get a good pole position. It's going to be 26 others. They're AI, but I've got them on pretty, pretty hard difficulty, so this should be a lot of fun. So yeah, let's go and get into it. We'll start her up right now. And we'll get straight into qualifying, hopefully. Bathurst is a is a really really good track. It's long. It's a long track, but I love it a lot. It's definitely definitely one of my favourite tracks. And it's an Australian track as well, which kind of makes me like it a little bit more. But um, yeah, I really love V8 supercars and racing. So let's get into this. Looks like we're about to start qualifying straight off the bat. We've got five minutes to do this in. Okay, take your time, get the tires and brakes warmed up, get a feel for the track, and see what you make of the car set up. Get our tires warmed up and all that, like you just heard the boss. Tires are blue, which means, you know, they're pretty cold. They should go green eventually. First lap, we're going to be a bit slower anyway, and yeah, she's definitely loose because they're cold. We just gotta warm up the wheels a little bit. Once they get warmed up though, we'll be right. I'm not using a wheel, I'm using a controller. I actually don't have a steering wheel. I would love to get a, a steering wheel eventually though. So we'll let this first lap of qualifying, we'll kind of just let it be a warm up, get a feel for the track again. And then once we hit that line, we'll go a bit harder. Almost the barrier. Tires are starting to feel a little bit better. Starting to get a little warmer. Go down the straight, almost getting to 300 k's per hour here at the end. I think we normally get to about 285 or something, depending. Tires are definitely starting to warm up a little bit. Try and go a bit harder anyway. See how this goes. Tires are pretty warm now, so we should be able to go a little bit harder. Definitely not my best entry and exit into a corner, especially that one. That was pretty bad, to be honest. Came close to the wall, I managed to fix it though. Otherwise it definitely would have been in the wall. This car's got very squirrely, lots of power. Lots of rear end wheel spin if you don't watch it, so. Gotta be pretty careful. Gotta love that gearbox squeal too, it just sounds amazing. Very legit. This will probably be our final lap here. We might get a second. I'm not sure how well we're doing. We're currently in first, which isn't too bad actually. Should 
which means we must be doing all right. Coming into the final turn here to get back on the final straight. Not a bad lap at all. It's pretty nice, to be honest. definitely be our final qualifying lap though this one. Way too close into the um, dirt back there. Definitely the final lap for qualifying though. Starting to get on top of the mountain. I don't know how much I'm going to talk while we're racing guys because I get pretty focused because I'm quite competitive. So I'm not sure how much I'll be talking during the actual race. So keep that in mind. We might be able to get an even better lap with this one, to be honest, maybe. I don't reckon we will. I don't feel like I hit some of these corners as well as that first, first lap, but I guess we'll find out. A little bit, <laughs> a bit too hard and fast into that, but that's all, all right. Our first lap was, that second lap we did was fine, whatever it was. But, um, yeah, we'll move on to the race, and we'll see how we go, guys. We're going to have pole position, by the looks of it. We're a little bit faster than the other guys, which is, which is a good thing. But, um, yeah, let's get into the race. Alright, guys, let's get this race underway. Not a bad start, our takeoff wasn't terrible, it could have been worse. Not quite going to have the room to get around him on the straight, so we'll just have to give him a bit of space for a minute. Once we kind of get that figured out, we're probably about to get rear-ended here, guy on the inside. Good thing about starting at the front is you've got a bit of, you know, a bit of space, a little bit more spread out to begin with in the middle of the pack where you're just fighting for the positions. These guys are on about 80% difficulty so maybe I should have put them all the way up, I don't know. I mean the guy in first isn't doing too bad. He's got a nice driving line, I guess he's AI though, he is a bot. too hot in there, that's okay. Climbing the mountain, now we're going down. Down the mountain we go.
both got a pretty, I think I had a little bit better exit speed there on that one. Almost a love tap. Cars are starting to come up each other's asses along here. This is where it's going to be all about exit speed and stuff like that. Pretty smooth race so far though, it's been pretty nice. We're in a lap 2 here, still 8 to go. Letting him know we're here, you know. I don't want him to think we're behind him a long way. These cars sound really good. I love them. We're going to have to try and get this guy soon though, I mean we've still got 8 laps but I feel we have the better speed into some of these corners than he does. A little bit loose in the back end on our part. Change back to this camera view before we go up the mountain. The climb is definitely one of the more important parts of the track and going down it as well. Oh, he's starting to make a mistake there. He went out a little squirrely in the back end. Definitely some nice speed coming up the mountain. That was really nice. Really nice run up the mountain. And down we go. We might be able to get him. Maybe not. Not quite going to have it there. We'll keep pushing and trying though. I mean, we'll get him eventually, hopefully. I had to hit the brakes a little bit there, I had a way better exit speed than he did. Otherwise I would have rear-ended him. Which is not what we want. I definitely love-tapped him just then though. I probably should have used my brakes a little bit more. We're going to try here and get up the inside. I think we might have got past. 
He's hard up the inside though. He's gonna have the inside of me on this, on the inside here, yeah. Just as I figured he would. Which is okay. We'll just keep pushing. Keep some of this pressure up. We'll try and get him on the on the way down. I just got to make sure I'm close enough. You don't want to give it too much back on that corner there, otherwise you'll just spin and spin out. But um, we're gonna try here. Oh, a little squirrely. Yeah, he had a bit, I squirreled a little bit too much in the back end just there. Had to give him some room, otherwise I wasn't going to make the turn. unfortunate. I lost a little bit of ground on him too on that corner back there. Still got the orange and black falcon behind us. We definitely seem to have the speed as well on the straights. We kind of get a lot closer to him. We had nice exit speed into that too. It's just nice. Nearly a love tap. That was very close. That definitely was a love tap. Trying to create some room. Little, little sloppy in the back end just there on my part. I'm definitely trying to push him now. We don't want to push too hard though to the point where we wreck, so I've got to be careful of that. The rest of the cars in the in the race are starting. To come up behind us as well. You can see that orange one in my rear view. It seems to be a little closer. I think he built a little gap there coming down. It's okay though. I'll keep pushing. Keep pushing and trying. Definitely had the exit speed. Maybe this is gonna be it. Down the inside, maybe. Boom, got him. Little sloppy in the back end. I felt good getting him on that corner. Been trailing him for five laps now. Good time though. 
thought we were definitely going to be worse. That's the wall. Bit of a love tap on the mirrors and everything. Coming down into the final corner here on the mountain before we start going down. Building a little gap, which is good. Got some interesting camera views on this game, which is nice. I don't know how we were faster, I felt like that lap was a lot worse in terms of the line I drove and everything. A little bit too much onto the apex there. Straight down the straight. Coming into lap eight here. loose in the back. Two laps to go. Anything could happen. Almost whacked the back end into that um, wall, which would not have been good. Definitely hit that wall. That was an accident. I doubt we'd have a mirror left, that's for sure. It's been a little bit too hard up the mountain.
Not doing a too bad a speed for this lap though. We've brought out the gap a little bit again. Which is kind of a good thing. Tires are starting to wear down. Very, very squealy on that back corner there. Two laps to go. Lap nine and then ten. Way too much onto the apex. Chuck it back into first. Yeah. Definitely not as quick going up the mountain that time. get a feel for it in third person for a little bit. Alright, let's make sure this is a good lap, guys. Up the mountain for the last time. And then we're going to begin the climb back down the mountain for the last time. It's been a very, very nice race. Not over yet though. We could still wreck. I don't want to wreck, but it's possible. May have built a decent gap, we have. This car drives really nice. Love it when I get that corner perfect. Coming into the final corner. A 
little too fast into it, but that's okay. Still got a decent gap. First place. Wow. Well, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. Um, I definitely recommend Project Cars 2. This is number 2. It's a really good game. I like the graphics, and I just I like the way the cars drive. Some people don't. I do. I guess it's just a preference. But, um, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks for watching.